Hi everyone, Emily from Bob's Watches here with another episode of Inside Watches, where I will share everything you need to know about watch collecting. Today we're going to answer one of the questions we get asked the most, how are Rolex watches made? But before we get into it, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Bob's Watches YouTube channel to stay up to date with all of our latest video content. Rolex is one of the most recognizable luxury watch brands in the world, producing 1 million watches each year from more than 100 different countries. As you can imagine, a lot goes into creating the world's finest timepieces, from the production of in-house metals to the intricate movements powering each watch. By understanding the process, I hope to help you gain a new appreciation for your Rolex. If you're familiar with the Rolex brand, you probably already know that the company is located in Switzerland. Production of Rolex watches actually takes place in four different facilities. Rolex HQ is located in Las Acacias. The cases and bracelets are made in the Geneva Plan Les Watts facility, which is also where the Rolex foundry that produces all of their 18 karat gold is located. The movements are produced in Bien, and the dials are made in Geneva Schenbourg. The entire process from start to finish takes about a year to complete. It's entirely self-sufficient, taking no shortcuts and using the finest technologies and materials on the market. While machines are still involved in various aspects of the production process, for example, attaching pins with a precise amount of pressure, every Rolex watch is hand-assembled for the most part. To put things into perspective, many other brands rely on machines to make watch components, such as the dials for efficiency. But Rolex is a different breed. Instead, they employ a massive team of various watchmakers and experts to hand-assemble each watch part. That means applying each hour marker by hand when it comes to the dial. Even the intricate movements powering each Rolex are painstakingly hand-assembled entirely in-house with the precision of just a few microns. It's absolutely incredible, and Rolex doesn't stop there either. Over the past several decades, the company has worked hard to bring as much of the production process in-house as possible. In doing so, they can control the quality of each component of every watch that leaves their factory, right down to the metal finish on each watch, which Rolex produces in-house. Rolex uses only the finest materials available on the market to make their proprietary 18 karat yellow, white, and Everose gold, as well as their 950 platinum. They also opt for superior 904L grade oyster steel over the industry standard 316L steel, despite being more labor intensive and expensive to work with. The result is a better selection of metal finishes that won't dull or fade as quickly over time as the materials used by other brands. Their in-house production also includes other components, such as the lubricants used in their movements, their famous chromolite luminescent material, and their trailblazing Cerachrome ceramic bezel material. With all of that in mind, it makes perfect sense that it would take a year to produce each Rolex watch. Unfortunately, that also means that many of our favorites are constantly out of stock because Rolex simply can't produce them quickly enough to keep up with demand while upholding their exceptional standards for perfection. And that's everything you need to know about how Rolex watches are made in a nutshell. Be sure to check back soon for another episode of Inside Watches. Until then, be well.